Yo, 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 what's going on out there, universe? It's your boy! Elevation, aka Fasted Sith, bringing you another video from the Galactic Empire. It is the Galactic Empire. Emperor of Fitness, now on to the video topic. And in this video, welcome to the series. I started this series a long while ago. It's called Sith on the Scale. And before, as you know, uh, previously in this uh, series, we were going to a doctor's office that was way out of the way and had to go drive and had to go wait and had to do all this, you know, back and forth stuff in order to get weighed. But your boy got his own scale. So we are going to cut off right here so you can see the weigh in and then we will come back and then we are going to talk about it and we're going to talk about the goals that we're going to hit this week what i could have did better last week and uh you know what are my weight loss goals for the month so i want you to watch the weigh in it's only going to be like a i don't know about a minute and 30 seconds long and then we will be right wow back. what's going on youtube it's uh what time is it it's uh it's like 1246, 1247, somewhere around there. I'm on the phone with my best friend, but she's AFK right now. But uh, uh, I'll give y'all uh, Sith, Sith on the scale. There's the scale. Whoops, I didn't mean to cut that on. But I'm looking crazy because I just got up not too long ago but we're gonna get this way in and record it for y'all and then we're gonna talk about our goals for next week and what we're trying to weigh in at so stay tuned. all right let's get on the scale again oops oops i gotta get the motherfucker Hello. off her So there you have it. It was 6:30 this morning, but 629.8. Y'all saw that? Y'all saw that? 629.8, bitch. But uh we I'm going to get myself together, get myself dressed. We probably going to sit down on the couch. Or we might sit down in front of the fireplace today. And we're going to talk about, you know, the previous week. And then we're going to talk about the goals for this week. And, you know, we're just going to chop it up and kick it. You know how we do. Welcome so back. stay tuned. And as you see, the scale said 629.8, I believe. Or was it 3? I can't remember. But, um, yeah, 629, you know. Uh, my original goal for this week was to hit 628, but, you know, I've been, you know, now you don't want to be a prisoner to the scale. You know, one thing about having the convenience of having my own scale now, shout out to the XL700. It's accurate. It does its job. And, uh, you know, it keeps me accountable. But one thing about having a scale is kind of you can get into that scale, um, you know living through the scale but the one thing I wanted to actually see this week on the scale is how where I was getting the most optimal weigh-ins where my body was what was what was it doing throughout the day and uh, just kind of tracking it mentally I didn't track it down uh, I might track it down next week for you guys to see if you guys care about something like that um, but uh, yeah, so throughout the day, in the morning when I wake up and I get eight hours of sleep, you know, whenever the morning is, usually the morning for me is around 8 to 9 a.m., but, uh, you know, on the weekends, it can be anywhere from 11 a.m. to 12 p.m. So, um, 
you know, in the morning when I wake up and I've, I've gotten optimal sleep, my weigh-ins tend to be really, really low. So, you know, um, obviously, I think that's the most accurate number because, you know, your body is, you know, recuperated. It's, you know, flushed all the liquids out, you know, going back and forth to go pee all night or whatever. And, you know, you're just going to be at your most optimum weight in the morning. Now, in the late afternoon, uh, after taking in my first two cups of water, which is about 60 ounces, I can put on anywhere from two to four pounds in the afternoon. By late day or late night, like maybe an hour to two hours before I go to bed, my weight is at its highest. So then my weight fluctuations can be anywhere from four pounds to seven pounds. I mean, I weighed myself the night before I did this weigh in and I was at 637. So, you know, when I was going through all that battles of, of trying to lose weight and, and uh, you know, worrying about what the scale was saying before, and I got to stay focused on the camera, stay focused on the camera, look right here at you guys. But when I was going to go get weighed in before, I was not weighing myself at the most optimum point in the day. I was weighing my, myself midday, usually right after workouts. Right after workouts, I don't know how my body reacts because I haven't really done a true blue workout. All I'm doing is walking and going on the treadmill, stretching, stuff like that. Keeping it basic and keeping it simple for right now until I figure out what this issue is. Um, and I might talk about that in a vlog. I actually might do a vlog today. Um, but... Uh, my most optimal weigh-ins are in the morning. So, you know, that's where my true weight usually is going to be. So, 620. And actually, when I took the picture for Instagram and Facebook, it was 630.2. So, it just goes to show that my body is a fucking water-retaining machine. You know what I'm saying? And, and I, even giving it water throughout the day makes my weight fluctuations go up extremely high. I mean, it's, it's crazy. You know, I've never seen nothing like that. You know, so, um, you know, that that's... That's how I feel about, or that, that's basically how my body runs, you know. And it's good to have a scale so you can see how your body runs, but you don't want to be a prisoner to it. So, uh, I'm definitely not a prisoner to it. I mean, you know, the weeks before, the last two weeks, I wasn't even weighing myself, you know, but once a week. So, you know, but I was always weighing myself in the morning, and those are the most optimum weigh-ins. Now, um, as far as goals for this week... You know, I still want to keep my goals realistic. You know, I'm shooting for 3.5 pounds a week. I've been actually crushing it the last two weeks. Um, I don't know if it's because of diet or it's just because my body's getting stronger and I'm able to walk longer distances. Or I don't know if it's because I'm actually using treadmills now. Or I don't know what it is. But whatever it is, I'm, I'm trying to replicate it and I'm going to keep on doing it. You know, my averages. Hold on, let me pull, pull my phone out. Um... You know, shout out to Evernote if you guys have Evernote. So, um, yeah, so last week I weighed 639.4 pounds. This week uh, I weighed in at 629.3 pounds. So that's a loss, of another 10 pound loss. The week before I was 649.2. The week before that I was 648.8. And then I stayed. I stayed at 648.8 or 3 the week before that, and then I was 653.8. If you guys want to see uh, a screenshot of, of my weigh-ins over the past uh, month, because I started actually dieting, or not dieting, but uh, I actually started changing my habits 5-15-2016. Um, so if you guys want to see that, I will uh, put a link down into the description to a Facebook post where you can kind of see my weigh-ins, because I think I'm going to put it up tonight anyway um so my goal for this week is 625 or less if i can get if i can get 620 this week i mean i'd be i would be shocked i would be amazed and i would be grateful but you know we're gonna keep it realistic i mean that's still kind of unrealistic five pounds in a week you know i i honestly should go for you know around 627 626 but you know the way my body's been acting and it's been receiving its workouts um you know, I don't think 625 is too much to ask of myself. So, uh, that's pretty much Sith on the Scale. 
you guys put down in the comment section uh, what you guys have weighed in this week. If you guys are on a weight loss journey, if you haven't, uh, you know, give me some feedback. Do you think my goal is too realistic? Do you think I should sue for 620? Do you think that's too unrealistic? Uh, you know, put 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 your guesses. You know, put put your guesses of what you think I'm going to weigh in at. Like I said, I think 625 is, is pretty much the magic number. Um, you know, the force. I'm using the force. Uh, but put what you think, or put just your thoughts musing opinions hate whatever the fuck you want to do and as always down into the description is all of my social media links so be sure to add your boy but anyway this is elevation a k a fast it says be good or be good at it bitches and remember baby steps lead to giant strides i will see you in the next video.